fucking lord. Don't freak out. No, what the fuck are you doing here, Jake? You know the fucking feds are looking for you? Yeah, that makes sense. Were they here? Yeah, man. How many? Uh, there were two of them. Said you broke out of prison. Thought I might go. Shit. No, I I'm asking the questions. How the fuck did you break out of prison? What the fuck are you doing here? Why were you in my cupboard? And what the fuck, man? Okay, good. No, that's good. They probably won't be back for a bit. Uh, you broke out of prison, Jake. I think they're gonna be back. No, man. They probably think I'm with the people I broke out with. Who'd you break out with? The, the, uh, the Fed said something about white supremacists. Yeah. I, uh, may or may not owe the Aryan Brotherhood a favor or two. Jesus Christ. I know. The Aryan Brotherhood? I know. So... What, you're like a Nazi now? What? No, fuck no. My cellmate was. You need protection in prison, bro? Pretty face like this? Come on. Anyway, my cellmate, uh... He took a liking to me. Started talking protection and breakout, yada yada. Next thing you know, I got a swastika on my arm, and I'm skipping the joints. Jesus, man. I know, but hey, hey, here's the thing, little bro. They don't exactly hand out free favors, so I'm gonna need to hide out here until things cool down. Is that cool? Is that cool? That, no, that, that's not fucking cool, man. I, I haven't seen you in four years, and now you just show up and ask me to help you hide from the fucking Nazis? No. And cops. What? And cops. They're both after me. And hey, I, I know I haven't always been the best brother to you. Like, I wasn't always there for you, but... Yeah, no shit. Yeah, but bro, I wanted to be. It's not my fault I got arrested. <laughs> not your fault. What, so somebody made you steal a car and rob a jewelry store? <laughs> okay, no, but it's not my fault I got caught. T you drove a car through a wall and robbed a jewelry store without a mask. A jewelry store, Jake, what? You didn't think they might have a camera on Okay, well sure, when you say it like that, it sounds obvious, No, but Jake, there's absolutely no way of saying it that doesn't sound obvious. And there's absolutely no way to classify what you did as anything other than a completely shit-brained, selfish idea. Do you have any idea what you did to mom and dad? You were completely taken care of. They gave you fucking everything. You weren't starving. You weren't from a bad neighborhood. Uh, you just broke their hearts and you left me to pick up the pieces. Look, man, I, I needed you. And you were nowhere. And now you're asking me to help 
harbor a fucking fugitive? No. No. The answer is no. Z-Man. I'm asking you to harbor your brother. Don't call me that. What? D-Man or my brother? Either. Okay. Sir. Four years. Yeah. You know I was in prison for five. Yeah, I know. So why'd you stop visiting? I just told you. Okay, so why'd you start, huh? You visited me once a month for a full year and then you just stopped. I mean, hey, I get never coming, if that's how you feel. But once a month, man. You had to miss me a little, huh? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Of course I missed you, man. You're my brother. I, I looked up to you. So what changed? Stop looking up. Started looking down. Right. Sorry. Yeah. Me too. You know, you're not the only one who needed a brother. Look, you can say I was selfish or stupid and... Gosh, you know what, you're probably right. But leaving you was not a decision that I made. I was taken. Yeah, it was my fault. But I was taken. Look, I'm, I'm sorry for the decisions that I made, and I'm sorry I couldn't be there for you. But I needed you too. Prison is fucked up in so many ways. But above all, it's lonely. That first year, huh? You coming to see me once a month? You stopped visiting. And that's when I truly felt alone. Probably what I deserved in the first place. Anyway, uh, thanks, brother. I love you. How long? A week. Two tops. And you have nowhere else to go? Not unless you want me to sleep in the sewers. <laughs> no. D-Man. Nowhere else. One week, two <laughs> tops. <laughs> Not a minute longer, brother. Oh, hey, I did have one more favor to ask you. What else could you possibly need? Oh. <laughs> uh, I mean, current situation. <laughs> what, Jig? You remember Jessica? Your girlfriend, Jessica? <laughs> yeah, that one. Yeah, Jake, I remember Jessica. <sighs> cool. Uh, you guys keep in touch at all anymore? Like, what do you mean? Keep in touch. You guys talk at all anymore? Uh, no, not really. Like, not at all, or? I mean, I see her, like, every once in a while, like, in the summers and stuff, but no. Well, I need you to get a hold of her for me. Why? Big plans, bro. You remember, uh, that jewelry store? Well, I only wanted one thing. And they never found it. Holy fuck. <laughs> I know, right? It's time to wipe that girl up. <laughs> this thing could feed a fucking orphanage. I know. Where did you hide this? Rather not say. Oh, uh, 
Man, have you thought this through at all? Z-Man, it's all I've been thinking about. And hey, hey, guess who the best man is going to be? You, bro! Hope you like Argentina! You are absolutely insane! I know. But don't act like you're not excited, bro. Fugitive wedding? It's gonna be the fucking shit! Dude, I can't get on board with this! <laughs> what? Why not? Because it's fucking ridiculous, Jake! What? You, you want her to run off to Argentina with you so you can get married on a beach? Fuck yeah. No, Jake. She has a life. She's gonna join the Peace Corps. She's got plans that can actually make a difference, and you'd be ruining that. Peace Corps? How do you know that? I thought you said you uh, didn't keep in touch. Mom told me. Peace Corps, huh? Fucking cool. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Wait, that's perfect. They go to all those third world countries and shit. I'll just join up once I get established in one. Jeez, man. <laughs> what? You're being ridiculous. Alright. I get it. This is a, like, a lot to put on you at once. How about we just sleep it over and we'll talk about it tomorrow? Sound good? Fine. Good man. Mm. Well, I, for one, can fucking beat. Probably gonna hit the hay, you know? Get some shut-eye?